my dear, we don't have any superwoman. No. We don't have any wonder woman. Okay? So when you are a woman, you are a wife, you are a mother, you are an entrepreneur, or you are even an employee, you are trying to do your best, okay, for your family, try to do your best for your career, you want to excel, give yourself a break, okay, give yourself a break. If you need to ask for help, please ask for help. We don't have any special powers, and we don't have any superwoman or any wonder woman, okay, it's just a fiction. When you face reality, okay, the stress is real. So if you need to ask for help, ask for help. And stop trying to do everything on your own. And stop trying to make everything perfect. Okay, you will make mistakes. Okay, your children, they will be okay. You are doing your best. So my dear, cut some cake and eat. Cut some cake and eat. You are so stressful. You are putting a lot of pressure on yourself. You are not taking care of yourself. You are taking care of every, everybody excluding you. You are taking care of everybody. You are taking care of your husband. You are taking care of your children. And you are not taking care of yourself. That is why you are stressed up. That is why there is so much pressure on you. You cannot give what you don't have. Before you can give love to your husband. Before you can give love to your children. You need to know how to lavish some love on yourself. How to lavish some love on yourself. How to take care of yourself. You need to know what you want. You need to know the thing that make you happy. You need to know that... If you cannot do it on your own, ask for help. When I gave birth to twins, I wanted to be a superwoman, a wonder woman. I tried doing everything on my own and my dear, I almost died. I almost died. I was taking care of my husband. I was cooking. I was taking care of the house. I was cleaning. I mean, my goodness, I almost died. Sometimes I would do some washing and then I would sit down to fold the cloth and I will get stuck on the chair. I will get stuck on the chair. I can't get up. So I asked myself, what is going on? So I went to God and I prayed. I said, Father, I need your help. I need help. I can't do this on my own. I was trying to be a superwoman. I was trying to do well in my career. Try to take care of my husband and be the best wife and be the best mother. My dear, we, you cannot have it all together. So give yourself a break. Do what you can. So long as you know that you are doing your best. And then ask them for help. It's important. Ask for help. If you need help. Okay. Ask for help. You see. Now I'm making the video. My son. <laughs> come here. Come here. <laughs> he's playing football. The way. <laughs> oh my God. The way he's sweating. Eh? What. What is it? So you see. <laughs> so. Do your best. Take care of them. But at the same time, learn to take care of yourself. Learn to do the thing that you love. Learn to associate with good friends. Learn to, learn to find your hobbies. And then do more of it. You cannot have everything. You cannot take care of others without taking care of yourself. And then you, are, you don't have to compare the style of your motherhood. Or um, the, the way um, you are doing your thing with other women. You are running your own race. So my dear, run your own race. Don't try to be like, Ishra, please close the door for me, please. Close the door. You see? So, you cannot, I mean, and sometimes you have to, you have to be hard on them. Sometimes you need to tell them that this is how things must be done. And be bold enough to do that. And ask your husband for help. Tell, tell him, my dear, I need you to help me. And if your husband is not helping you and you need an external help, you know, we have a lot of people who can come to your house and clean and then they will go. They will not stay in your house. They will just work and then you pay them and then they go. That is why I always tell women that your first love is God. Build a personal relationship with God so that you can ask him for direction. The Holy Spirit is there to teach you all things. And then at the same time, make sure you have a career. Make sure there is something that you are doing. Don't just put everything on the man. Do something. You are full of potentials and talent. Do something for yourself. And stop neglecting yourself. Okay? And, but you cannot do everything perfect. So whatever that you are able to do, thank God for it. Appreciate it. And then you will make mistakes. It's normal. You will make mistakes. Sometimes you don't intend to shout on them. But some, sometimes they will do something and then it will get on your nerve and you may shout. It's okay. You learn from it and ask the Holy Spirit to empower you with a spirit of patience so that you'll be able to patient, you'll be able to be patient with them. So, my dear wife, my dear mother, entrepreneur, employee, give yourself a break. You are doing your best. Don't compare your journey with anyone's journey. Okay, motherhood is very stressful. It's not easy to be a mother, it's not easy to be a wife.